downloaded a fan-made anime game with over 200 plus characters, and for the purpose of this video, it might as well be 20. That's right, today I want my two favorite anime franchises of all time, Dragon Ball Z and Naruto, to go head to head. That's right, these are without a doubt my two favorite franchises of all time, and look at these rosters we got here. We got the original Dragon Ball Z characters, plus Goku Black and Broly, two very good inclusions. Then we get into the Naruto stuff, and we have a lot of good Naruto characters here. Some extra stuff. It stops at Madara. We do have the Boruto cast on here, but um... <clears throat> We're just gonna go back up here real quick. You know, I actually am a fan of the Boruto manga, though. Just uh, for, <clears throat> for this video, we're sticking to OG Naruto. So, of course, for the first match of this video, we gotta go with the big guns. Let's start it off how we need to start it off with Goku and Naruto head-to-head. -head. Hey, look at my guys in the ring, though. I love to see it. The King of Fighters ring? Here we go. Who do we think takes this here? Obviously, for, was that a paper bomb shuriken? My guy Naruto kind of letting Goku know right now. Another paper bomb. Goku not gonna let it happen. He's got him in the corner now. The Shadow Clones are so good. A any fighting game with Naruto, you know a DS Naruto fighting game go crazy when he got Shadow Clones. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh my God, reverse harem jutsu. Oh my God, it worked on Goku perfectly. Oh, nah. Yeah. And Goku's got some key blasts. So I'm actually surprised Naruto is leveling him this bad. What are the feats? Can we get some power scaling in the comment section? Do oh, a level three. He transformed. Nah, Naruto is going crazy. Look at the speed. Did he just throw a single shuriken? Did my guy really transform just to throw more shuriken? The speed feats. He's by Rasen shuriken. Nah, call the ref. My guy Goku is done. He can't beat him. The nine tails fox. He's too fast. He's throwing tails beast bombs just for fun. Nah. It's over. Round one is going to Naruto. He interrupts the Rasa Jerkin. Wait, could this be Goku's insane comeback? He's still got a bar. Plenty of key to throw some key blast. And he's going to spam it the spirit bomb. Nah, he said shut up. Naruto really said put that spirit bomb away. <laughs> That's only round one though. Goku really doesn't get going until round two. Now Goku has some transformations on the board. So is this going to be where Goku calls it? Is Goku really going to go 2-0? Oh? The Uzumaki Barrage. Put some respect on Naruto's name. Barrage of Fist from Goku. But he hasn't transformed just yet. Another paper bomb. Oh, Naruto is planning something devious. Goku with a hell of a combo. Naruto trying to do something devious. It's a transmission. Behind the back, they're actually going to clash. Naruto stops his ultimate right where it needs to be. Rasengan into the Demon Wind. Into the paper bomb. OTG. Naruto plays fighting games. You can catch Bro playing Tekken 7, Dragon Ball Fighters. He plays them all. Why, why is Goku doing so good this fight? He's just doing the basic combos, but Naruto has no defense. He's trying to talk no jutsu him. Oh my god, he slammed him back into the corner. Another Rasengan. Wow, count me surprised. How many Rasengan? Oh my god, he's getting jumped! He's got seven shadow clones on that. He, he destroyed them all in one elbow. God, that was crazy. Another Rasengan. No, Goku, Goku, you gotta clutch up. Goku, you gotta clutch up right now. Don't go out like this. Don't go out sad. At least transform. Tap into a power, Goku. Tap in. He's got no meter. He's got no meter. Naruto has all the pressure. Ah, it's over. It's over. It's over. Goku. He's going to keep fighting. What a combo. T-Blast OTG. No! Naruto with a sliver of health is able to clutch it up and bring Goku down. He raises a single fist in victory. Look at him. A chip Skylark smile on his face. Just his shiny teeth in him. And he secured the first win for Team Naruto. Nah, you know what? Run that back. I want to see another 1v1. Then we'll do some tag matches because I got to see Vegeta versus Sasuke. Oh, look at that Mangeki. Whoa, whoa, why did Vegeta take all his clothes? <laughs> <laughs> Why did bro ditch the armor? Or was he wearing the jacket? I don't know. Did, did he really just steal, plagiarize the Destructo Disc? Susano, that was crazy. Forget about the plagiarism notice on Destructo Disc. The full perfect Susano? That was insane. They gave Sasuke everything in this game. And he's got combos. Now, why is Team Naruto a little OP in this game? Oh, the Super Dash. My guy played fighters. He just like me for real. Key Blast, that was a classic Vegeta move. You just remember watching Dragon Ball Z. You know Vegeta sent out a bunch of Key Blasts. You know whoever he was sending those at was not about to go down to that. I don't think that technique ever worked. Super Dash. Oh, he's charging up. He doesn't want the bar, though. He only charged enough for two Key Blasts, and he used it all. Throw Sasuke out of the corner. Into the Destructo Disc to follow it up with Super Dash. That was an insane combo. Vegeta is popping off. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, Sasuke going to have to clutch up. This is too big of a health lead. Vegeta clears low difficulty. Nice combo on the ground. Destructo Disc hits OTG into the... That was efficient. Wow. That was the work of a Saiyan warrior right there. That was clean. Sasuke started off that first match strong. I just don't know where all the potential went. Oh, he put him under Genjutsu. Caught in midair. Vegeta was gazing into his eyes lovingly. 
I, I don't know what Sasuke was trying to grab with that Susano arm. Oh! Oh! <laughs> that was sick. This game is sick. I gotta be honest. Three bar. Whoa! Sasuke going for his ultimate. Oh! That did a lot of damage. Vegeta's transforming. Oh my goodness. All of a sudden, something just snapped. He's missing every punch he's throwing. <laughs> Bro, bro thought Super Saiyan was going to solve all his problems. That was a sick combo, but not good enough. Sasuke has too big of a health lead. Vegeta's going to need eight more of these. Wait, oh, excuse me. Why did that do a million damage? Never mind. Vegeta's going to win. Oh! <laughs> Mid air. Vegeta's going to tie it up for Team Dragon Ball Z. All right. Now I want a tag match between both Gohan and Piccolo versus hmm, who do we get here that's good for a tag side on Naruto? Uh, I'm thinking, you know what? We might just have to go with the two villains, Obito and Madara. Yeah, why not? Let's see if Gohan and Piccolo can take down uh, the Naruto world's greatest duo threat. Man, that sentence had like eight periods in it. Oh, they all screaming at once. Team Team Naruto actually got a background that fits them. All right, so you know how it works. In tag matches, it's 1v1, but they can tag out at any time. Why is Obito built like that? He is fast. My God. Oh, he tagged out Namadura. He just wanted to show off his speed feats. Gohan kind of looking like a... Obito's back in to try to get... It. He sucked Piccolo into the, the Kamui dimension. I'm going to be honest. Obito and Madara kind of look like a well-oiled team. Piccolo with a dash up like grenade. Okay, Piccolo, show us what you really about then. Gohan kind of just flexing, I guess. Madara's taking a bit of damage, but nothing I'm worried about. Wraps him up. Okay, now Madara needs a timeout. He needs to tag Obito back in. Susano or not, he doesn't. he's not doing it right now. Charging up in the corner. What's he got? He tags out Nobito. That was the best move he could have made. Obito has been clutching up all game. Even if he does look like he lost his neck when that boulder crushed him. Whoa! Bro's jutsu covers half the screen. There we go. Now that's a moderate worthy combo. Piccolo needs to break away. He's low on health. He's going to super dash. Get behind Madara so that he can push him even further into the corner. And then blast Madara away. It's a tie game between Piccolo and Madara's health. They're both low. One combo could do it for either of them. Madara lower than Piccolo. Gets hit by the explosive wave and he's out. Madara is out of the game. Obito is going to have to clutch up. But Gohan shows no sign of slowing down. But Obito doesn't either. By God, he is just doing... Uh, he's blinking across the field. He's spamming Kamui. Bro's going to be seeing nothing on that visual test. He is going blind for sure. He might, he might already be blind the way he was fighting the air like that. He has lost the light in his eyes. And he is still spamming his visual prowess. A classic fireball. You know he's from the Uchiha clan. The fireball jutsu comes flying out. Oh! Oh my god, he just stabbed Piccolo. He could finish Piccolo right here with his next jutsu. Obito's got one bar. He's got two. He's all the way up at three. And he's going to use all three bars in his ultimate to summon the ten tails. My god, Piccolo never stood a chance. But what's he going to do about Gohan? Oh, I think Obito finally went blind. But Gohan didn't. He's beating him senseless. How dare you do that to Piccolo? You're about to catch a beam attack. Obito blinks back to throw a fireball jutsu. It's closer than anybody thought. Almighty push into the um, impure tentails. That almost killed Gohan. Gohan's going to dig deep and have to find something here. Oh my god, Obito locks it up for Team Naruto in the tag match of the century. And he takes it in a one-match format. Team Naruto has done it again. Obito mostly did it. Let's be honest. Madara kind of went out sad. Nah, you know what? Now I want to see the father and son match. Give me Goku and Gohan versus Minato and Naruto. It's two to one favoring Naruto right now. Can Dragon Ball Z tie it up in the father-son match? Bring your son to work. They going crazy right now. Oh man, it's so hard to tell Goku and Gohan apart. Oh, Minato going crazy. Rasengan. He's blinking everywhere. He's too fast. Gohan can't even see him. Now look at, actually Minato does negative damage. I'm, I'm pretty sure bro was healing him with that combo. Now Naruto actually does some real damage. Rasengan go crazy. He might not have created the jutsu, but he definitely perfected it. Damn, Naruto actually kind of good in this game. He has taken half of Gohan's health already. Gohan just can't seem to land a combo. Oh my God, Minato's out here doing negative damage again. He tags back into, no, Minato's back out. Gohan manages to block it without being able to see him and backs him off so Goku can come in and take a turn. Gohan back out again. But unless he has some sort of hidden potential, Naruto just lets him charge up though. He secures Goku two bars to use, but will Goku actually use it? Goku goes with a standard combo that we've seen before. Him and Naruto have already clashed in this video, so Goku wants a piece of his dad too. Spirit Bomb! Minato does not, is not able to dodge it so much for light speed feats. Oh my goodness, Goku broke his armor. Minato didn't stand a chance. Goku can see every move he makes. Minato decides to clone the shuriken. 
Instant transmission still not fast enough to keep up with Minato. Gohan tries to fire a move off, but instead just gets embarrassed. Gohan able to block all of that. He does a good job, but the Rasengan finally opens him up. Thankfully, Minato does two damage at most. High speed combos. He's finally adding up some damage. The Rasengan is by far his most potent move. Naruto has a million Shadow Clones out again. I don't know if Gohan can handle this. The Shadow Clones are still out while Minato's out. It's a father-son combo. It's a father-son beatdown. Rasengan into Rasengan. It's insane. Gohan has fallen. It's up to Goku now. It's a double Rasengan father-son duo. Unreal. The synergy between our Naruto duos out of this world. The Shadow Clone and Minato are simply too good to be stopped. I think Minato broke the game. He's back! Minato jumped to the air. I don't know where he went, but he's back. Another Rasengan. Insane. Another Rasengan. He tapped into Sage Mode. I think this might be over. Minato simply stepped on the gas. Once Naruto came out to help, Minato did not want to let his son down, and he has shown us that here today. It's about to be over if Goku doesn't do anything to stop this. Another Rasengan, and Naruto is going to come out to finish the job. It might not be over yet, but you just know it's about to end any second now. Goku, a valiant effort to stay alive here. But that's gonna be all she wrote, the demon win shuriken. And the father-son duo have taken a win. I think Minato just went to heaven. Oh my goodness, that was sad. Now, now let me see two of my most iconic villains. You just know that if you go to the gym, you are going to see a car with either a Goku black sticker or a Tachi sticker on it. It's just facts. It's just the way life is. So now we're gonna see which one of them wins in a 1v1. Woo, both their intros kind of go hard though. Both their intros kind of went hard in this game. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold up, let them fight. Let them go after each other then. They're both charging up. We're actually seeing some respect between our two opponents here. Both at three bars, they both have access to their ultimates. And Itachi's going for it. He puts them in the Genjutsu. Goku Black, he can't escape now. How much damage did it, that did like a little bit of damage? Itachi's losing his mind. Another Genjutsu. Itachi got him in three Genjutsus. Bro cannot stop looking into his eyes. He need a map. Goku Black need a map. He's lost in Itachi's eyes. Goku Black uses instant transmission, but it's not going to be able to keep up with Itachi's fire Phoenix Flower Jutsu. Goku Black tries to charge up, but another Genjutsu is going to come out. Itachi is fast. I'm sorry. We might not see Goku Black do anything. Oh my God. He's just spamming at the... Uh, look at his hands. Look at the hand speed. Damn. Bro is throwing everything in his pockets. I'm surprised we didn't see some loose change get thrown out there. It's over for Goku Black. Bro landed one hit, maybe two max the entire set. Okay, now he heard me talking trash. He wants to fight back. But it's already too late. Wait a minute. Maybe it's not too late. He misses the Divine Lasso. But maybe he's actually... Maybe he's been... Wait, has he just been holding back? Has he been sandbagging? No shot. He does a lot of damage with those key black... Oh, a single slice... And it's over. Atachi takes this win. Oh my god, the crows. I'm doing best of one for that. Team Naruto takes it again. All right, I'm gonna be honest. I've lost track of the score, but I'm gonna say it don't matter. Wipe the score clean, because I've been hiding a secret. Both Goku and Naruto are capable of evolving into their final forms. So now we're gonna see the real final match. Winner takes all between Goku Ultra Instinct and Baryon Mode Naruto. It's not actually winner take all, but I did want to see these two fights. So whoever wins, just add it to the score. We'll see what happens. My God, oh, UI Goku starting off strong. We got to see something from Bear. Wait, wait a minute. He kind of going crazy. Wait a minute. He kind of went crazy. Oh, he's got a key blast for him and he's disappearing off the map. This one is going to be a two out of three though. I want to see these two go the distance. Right now, UI Goku kind of going nuts. Naruto tries to do something, but UI Goku not going to let it happen. My God, he's getting them back for their first match. The first match of the video, Goku wants some revenge. Naruto not content to just let it happen. He's starting to fight back, but he's going to have to dig a little deeper. He Honestly, at this point, he's just going to have to hope his second round is better because UI Goku is not playing around. But will Naruto get 2 owed? Oh my God, Goku even goes back to base in between just to flex. Naruto a much stronger start in the second round, but Goku again just gets him into a corner. And he uses the same super to punch him. My God, Naruto's got to fight back. Naruto's got to fight back. It's just not looking good. Naruto again lands a flurry of attack, disappears to throw some projectiles. I can't be sure what he's doing. Another armor break from Goku. Spams the punches in the corner. My God, the supers are flying. Naruto's going to throw a flurry of punches too. Knocks him away. This is Naruto's only chance to get out of the corner. And he takes it. Tries to back Goku into the corner, but both competitors are a little too fast for that trick to work. It's almost over. He lands a counter super, but he needed his opponent to be closer. Oh no, could it be over for Naruto? One more hit will do it. 
He's out of the corner, but Goku sees him escape and knocks him down. It's over. UI Goku takes it in the evolved form fight. You know what? Now I'm just going to get a little crazy. This is going to be almost unreadable, but I'm going to get every character we didn't see on the Dragon Ball Z side and every character that we didn't get to see on this side. I'm just going to throw them into the ring simultaneously, see who wins. Let's see what happens. This will be the final match of the video, the final installment of Naruto versus Dragon Ball Z. Oh my god, it is so loud. They're all doing their intros at once. I, I'm not gonna lie. If I was Team Naruto, I would be scared. I would be terrified right now. Let's see what happens. Is this even gonna... Oh my god, it's a flurry of punches. I can't even tell what's happening. Gar was air dashing. Bro is air dashing. Gar just flexing in the air. Oh, he put himself in a sand bubble. Broly's doing something. Did Bro just transform? Oh no, Frieza did. He's Golden Frieza. Oh my god, Kakashi's comboing Golden Frieza. Jesus, I can't tell what's happening. Broly's throwing beams. Frieza's doing death slicers. Kid Buu's screaming in the corner. Kid Buu's been screaming in that corner for so long. It's because Team DBZ keeps using his bar. Buu is 1v3 over there. Somebody get Buu some help. He's getting 1v3. Oh my god, he got put in the sand coffin. Frieza's finally here to help. Oh my god, Team Naruto never stood a chance. My ears never stood a chance. Broly's doing the movie thing. Damn, he's spared the damn. Damn, help, somebody help. <laughs> oh my God, what happened? I don't think Team Naruto was ever in the lead once. Oh my God, Broly's like eight foot five. Um, well, uh, thanks for watching. I, I, I think, um, I think Naruto won. Uh, but did that scientifically prove anything? Uh, no, probably not. But hopefully it was fun anyway. Like and subscribe if it was. And um, uh, I, I guess this is goodbye. Goodbye.